Hello everyone, this is Floxcat, and welcome to another GP Read Theory video. And also, sorry for the window being uh, sloppy, looking messy. It's because there's a lot of residue on it, or not residue, or whatever the do of do, but do or whatever. I don't know. And of course, that means it's not going to be shown, but that's fine because today is a very interesting day as today we're going to finally break down something that has happened this week and I kind of have a little bit of, of explaining to do because a lot of people may have noticed something happened and it's very it's kind of a very intriguing thing that has been coming up lately I don't know how to explain what's been going on, but it's definitely a weird scenario that has been kind of going weirdly weird. I mean, I don't know what to say, but let's go ahead and dive right in into what's going on. So pretty much if you guys have been, been literally living on a rock of my channel, which I wouldn't blame you. And here comes more beep backups, because someone's getting picked up. <laughs> if you guys have been, not been keeping up to date of my channel, or have been just watching my uh, Pokemon X videos, which I wouldn't blame you, since I love doing that series, you probably have not uh, been self-aware of what's been happening with my channel and how things have been laid because I recently released at least one video there's another video no joke like literally and I'll get to the reason why in a bit and hold on for a second all right that's much more better more clear and pretty much what's been going on is apparently someone and let me just kind of go ahead uh Someone sent me, oh, no, nope, I'll reply, I already replied to him with a link, I'm trying to get to a link, cancel, cancel, there we go, that's all I needed, someone has sent me this video, which is from Naomi, which is in fact a Naomi video, this ain't like no Game Jack thing, this is in fact a Naomi video, and it's called Reports 8921, which if I have to do a theory, it does not have slashes, so it's August 9th, 21, which means that this video is way early, and let me see if it really is early, because it's been a while since I looked at this. Yeah, it is. It really is August, da da da. So it's a report about Soul Corp, and what happens here is there's nothing too much. First, we see this red or you know, I think lavender in color, because, you know, it has to be, and I'll get to the reason why in a bit. And, oh, I just realized, these are probably just symbolism of Naomi's if we look closely. I don't know. I guess someone got to brighten up the screen. Ni then we get to Naomi's Overwatch monologue, blah, 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 functional premieres, normal machine stuff, which we'll get into. Naomi primary system one, J and B. Siren functioning, pink siren, pink functioning, magenta is offline, Vardata, or whatever the hell that you pronounce that is functioning, which by the way, I bet a million bucks these are all colors, I mean, we all know magenta, red, and pink is colors, I just don't know these guys, and of course, magenta is offline, the rest is active, of course, functioning, blue is functioning, what are this color is? Obsidian is offline, Cyan's offline, Bronze is functioning. Green, Blanca, and Blanco is functioning, which is big because Blanca and Blanco is the female and male versions in Spanish of white. I mean, there's two whites. Then apparently there's Yellow Sun and Yellow Moon, which, okay, more Sun and Moon reference, offline. Clear is functioning, and of course we see Avatar 1, Scanny Inconclusive, of course my computer's acting like an idiot, functioning, Avatar 2, 
functioning out R3, offline 4, functioning 5, and the rest is are offline. And of course, updating Lavender. And then all of a sudden, we see flashes of GP Reed. Oh, yeah, and also restarting Naomi. And we also see spiders, apparently. And, you know, we see GP Reed, which is possibly at the first video, Leaker Erase. And we also see some flashes there. I didn't catch that yet. All access granted. Yeah, okay. Well, that's not too big. But, of course, this is obviously very interesting, and we even see some things like this, which is, please send a copy of these notes in my personal inbox. As the LVR begins to take over school corp duties, we need to monitor it at all times. I have, have a member of your team assigned a task by tonight, attach their files to the document as well. This is very experimental software. I cannot have to repeat of Jova. And of course, I bet millions of bucks this is LVR stands for Lavender. Now, also, you might be wondering, okay, this is another video that looks like I missed, right? Yes and no. Yes, I did miss this because really it's unlisted to the point where I'm surprised it was was leaked to me. And the second is, yes, it is leaked to me because it's unlisted, which apparently in in YouTube terms, I'm going to leave it on my website, but it's going to be hide for the rest of the world to not see. Believe me, look at Blame on George. He recently re released his vid videos, but they're all unlisted. I don't know why. But anyways, the reason why I bring all this up is because how I recently got that thing, which has caused a lot of surprise. I will see I still have that email because I've been deleting my emails whenever I do my art thing. But, this is because recently, the way I got my thing, which I already sent pictures of even on my thing, yeah, I think I already do got it, hold on, here it is, is the fact that this was sent to me, and people are already translate this, by the way, so if you guys want to go find that translate, actually I'll have it on the screen, yes we know, da 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 da. I love you, Japanese, the SCP Foundation, and the link which actually could be where it lead me to. Even though, if you saw my previous video of me showcasing that leaked video, apparently, um, that was only in my history. So, once again, I'm being hijacked. And this is even further from the truth, because apparently... The latest video before this, er, someone somehow, I don't know how to even explain this thing. It looks like someone secretly broke in, which would be hard to do since this whole place is thing. And I'm surprised they never took anything. But obviously they used my computer and sent Morse code. Yeah, whoever sent me this email has something to do with me in some way. I've been already dosing, it's already been drawn on a map. It's just that I don't know what they. Like, they don't seem fretful because so far they haven't truly done anything towards me other than hack my devices and spread their messages. And this has happened before. But, uh, I don't know. I've been seeing you guys. And by the way, I'm not denying that I have seen you guys. Stuff. It's just still confusing to me because, to make a long story short of it, and by the way, the title card alone, in fact, let me go ahead and pull up the Discord, because someone did translate the whole thing, well, and pretty much it's kind, it's kind of weird and wonky and like, I, I, I'm going to be honest with you. I have no idea what's now going on. I mean, to be frank, it's definitely weird, but it's not that bad. Luckily, it's not going to go insane, at least is my... That's the best way I can say. That's the, the holy best way I can say. I gotta look at my things first while I talk. Just FYI. Yeah, boy. I'm gonna 
also save this video, this thing up while before I do leaks, just because I want to see my regular thing. Okay, and come on. Which, by the way, thank you all so much for looking at that video of mine's. I mean, I know I was the first to do that, but I did send a link so you guys. But still, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. And here's the thing that was said. It says, "Hello, dear. I am." Carosa, I think it's actually supposed to be Rose. Look at this. We have a common enemy, and I leak this to you. Per. For sure. Eh. I don't know if they really did a good. I don't know where this one came from, but I do know that, according to her. Her. I mean, it could be the same, could be, but I don't know. But yeah, that's what it says, and pretty much what, it, what it may still not be a clear cran translation because we all know Google translation kind of sucks. But it does seem like they do have a common enemy, and they leaked it to me. I'm not gonna look into it. I mean, I guess I'll let you guys look into it. I'm just a, but I'm I'll keep my eye out on everything, but. I don't know what's going going on. So far in my life, what's been going on is I've been doing Pokemon videos. Because of Pokemon X. That's why. Okay. <laughs> That's not a pun. Alright. Of course, though, my life is not the big thing here. It's the main, the main thing of this video is that leaked video that was linked to me. Leaked to me. Well, it wasn't even leaked because if you... Okay, if you were to have... Your projects and put it unlisted on your YouTube channel. Chances are someone's gonna literally look at them. That's just being factual. I mean, yes, it was unlisted. I mean, it wasn't belonging. But still, someone could have did that. Is that possible? It doesn't even require hacking to find that thing. I think I don't know. But what does this mean in general? Well, obviously, it's pretty much interesting. And I do have a couple of theories on what it could mean. My biggest theory is, to be exact, is that obviously this goes back to why what was said in the number two video of Keith Reads. You know, when Grant peered in grass and like what happened because he was probably instant transmission by the computer or something. But what's interesting is this shows that Naomi is artificial light life and there's no denying there's no b way of proving it oh wait there is because of, yeah i'm not making any sense but the point is there's no way of them denying this because if i leak a video which i did because not only did i left the video like that even though it was ver very much a weird one but I also have the link of that video in the description, which I will link the video down in the description of this video as well, if you want to take a good look. There's no denying it. And even then, it wasn't really a leaked video because it was just an unlisted YouTube video. I mean, how do you... I mean, I don't know. It's definitely weird. But... But what's interesting about it is this confirms three things. First of all, lavender could be just another color of the Naomi's. And how this will happen is I don't know. But I'm having a lot of bet that lavender could be a new Naomi. So this can drop my theory way off the chart, meaning that lavender is not a company. It's just another color that Naomi is going to be using. Unless they're going to do... A thing, I don't know. But it is some sort of project they're going to do. And probably he's going to be a new boss of Soul Corp. And the second thing to combine to come from this is that Naomi is robots. There's no doubt about it. Or artificial life or something. My theory is it could be the fact that there could be actually human. But have cyborg legs stuff on them, like, you know, like the whole cyberpunk thing, or cybers from Hugo veterans, because I can't help but notice how organic they are, and I wonder if they really are being organic, but it would explain why it could be possible that mother and father that was mentioned before could be alive, 
But it also explains the whole brain thing if you go one step further, because that means they're putting chips in their brain. And, yeah, this took in a sci-fi tool, which kind of also backs up the whole alchemic thing, because the alchemic medicine, because they're probably using old stuff to help do secret brain surgery and put chips in their brains. Unless it's not just brains and other stuff. I don't know. But it does make sense in that regard. And it explains why the Naomi speak in robotic terms. Of course, it's unknown if they're cyborgs or robots. But it does make sense that they have mechanical and cybernetic stuff towards them because of this. And it does... I do agree with one thing that J.P. Reed has been asking. What does offline mean? Like, I don't know. But the third and final thing to take from this is apparently there are more Naomi's there that I thought. And the interesting part about it is that there's two whites and two yellows. There's two whites that are named Blanca and Blanco, which are technically, you know, both possibly male and female whites. And of course, there's. Pretty much a yellow moon and yellow sun. Again, another menage to moon and sun. Even though they're dropping that thing. So, yeah. I mean, I don't know what to say. All I say is, okay, just, per just confirms that Naomi is part of some machine. Like, it's already been stating. And backs up to what I appear to be whoever sent that, you know, mail thing. But it does kind of... Begs the question of what's the end goal of Naomi now? Because I originally thought this was, and I still think it is still evil organization. But now I'm starting to think that Naomi is more of a tool to Soul Corps. Like the best way to describe it is I keep mentioning this and I even made a joke of it. Which, by the way, Naomi kind of jokingly commented on my um uh my freaking you know. My video where I make fun of them. Even though that comment didn't have to have been hidden. Because apparently YouTube doesn't like doesn't like comments on Pokemon Y apparently. But if we were to use that ideal. It would be like the grunts from Team Flare. And even further just tools. Or if we were to use Team Flare knowledge. And this is kind of spoilers for those who haven't played Pokemon X or Y. Later on in the end, during a section, which is kind of a last arc of the story, there is the thing where you go to Looker, which, by the way, I'm trying to summon Pokemon Y so I can play it. But apparently, at the towards the end, it's revealed that the E-Robot wasn't really a robot, and it was Emma that was being controlled of the lash, dim, uh, a lash, hold on, I don't know. As a last ditch attempt from Zacharis from Team Flare, you know, the scientist. And I'm not saying his name right, but, you know, he starts with the letter X. So, what does this mean? I don't know. But whatever it does mean, it means something very big. And I can't help but put a conclusion towards that. And it kind of also backs up to what happened with. Melody, in some way, if I'm saying her name right, you know, the one who was smiling with a freaking thumbs up after it looked like he was drug. It may not be a drug. It may be actually computer chips being forced, because now when you think about it, he's talking telepathically to, uh, uh, robot stuff. And, you know, there's no doubt that there's another symbolism from here. And again, I'm still debating whether or not I could go back on my word and do that symbolism video. It's going to probably suck. But, but you know, I probably will probably do one. But it's no doubt that there is relationship or inspiration from a certain ARG of this. Because now when we go further and further of it, I can't help but wonder with it. But then again, we'll see how that goes. Anyways, this has been Floxcat. And I'm definitely snapping out of here, because I need a lot of rest. This has been very weird. Alright, bye.